all right cable's back on the grind and today i'm gonna show you three games uh i just recorded in the middle of the thing so i'm gonna be live games i know some people kind of like their live games first guy opponent is this guy but he dc'd um you know they saw the profile being scared off and uh, yeah, that happens probably three to five times a day on average so, uh, yeah, we appreciate what you did, but I actually can't ask for them because that's cheating. Yeah, so uh, we get quite lucky. We get a short map. I try and radio up on there. He skips it. We find Hydra Dam. We can use our similar lightning bolts, jam pack, team tower, sun strategy. That's been my best strategy so far. I can't remember more than one time I've lost with it in the whole of this grind and in a lot of games so far. And over 150 wins. So, um, yeah, it's been really strong for me, and um, yeah, so it was a big part of my 24 win streak, which, you know, 24 win streak in Borough Pit uh, by itself is like alright, but the fact that I've done it while grinding with just aggressive, speedy stuff means that it was done in like an hour and a half, and um, yeah, I didn't even really realise until I checked back, and I, was like, oh, I think maybe I've got maybe like 8 to 9 games, and it's like 19 games in a row, it's like, damn. Anyway, yeah, so Hydra Dam, the boat spot, uh, kind of suck on this, so uh, you want to send pinks, and then his boats were okay, he over-defended that a little bit, I think it's best, unless they have salted wounds, which uh, is why I drag the lightning in case they use assaulted, I'm going to use that lightning straight away to try and prevent any leaks. And he saves his boat to go for a farm, send more pinks again, and then into black, sent a couple too many pinks, so the blacks are sent a bit later, and this is just to try and grind him down slowly on live so that when we budget we don't need as many balloons to go by until there's less chance of him getting a uh, low life clutch and so yeah we're just gonna keep farming on uh, i don't know where place to farm it on okay we wait for the boomer and now i'm gonna hit him with a jam packed rush you know reveals he has the lightning so when they have lightning it means that round eight rush is not gonna get too far nor round uh, your round 11 waits so you're gonna have to wait till round 13 and hope you go first. And then, yeah, so uh, we're gonna lightning bolts that just so that we can get the farm just for a little bit more money. And now um, he's gonna send a little rush, but um, our defense perfectly handles that until the camos came by, which is a slightly bigger rush. And then the camo leads, he has to get the cannon ship upgrade. Then we just send in loads of rainbows, jam packed, and team tower stun, and that finishes his life count off the lightning. Doesn't defend it well enough uh, with the team that was done on the jam pack. So that was the first game into the second game. It's this guy called Cobra who uh, doesn't play Cobra. Another short map, Zen Garden. Went for the same strat again. This is definitely, uh, yeah, so I've not been using the upgraded balloons that much, uh, partly because uh, I tried to do it without sniping the powers against a guy with 40k meds who I didn't think would have lightning. Then he had lightning, and then I lost to him, this noob, uh, well, maybe not a noob, he was okay. You know, if he could beat me, you can't be terrible, so, um, that's what I mean. But, um, yeah, I lost to him, I shouldn't have lost to him, I was using this strat, uh, or just any, I think it was a longer map, so that's another reason why I lost. But, uh, anyway, this one's just safer as well, it's also because if they use the Cobra with the upgraded balloon strat, you just do the lightning bolts, and then the dazzling gunner, uh, one dazzling gunner will then defend. Yeah, nicely. So, um, yeah, I'm just going to keep going on. This guy has the lightning bolts as well, so um, we uh, try and bait some of them out. But, um, yeah, so in this position, uh, we don't want to upgrade our Darkling Gunner. He didn't send us enough greens, so we didn't reveal the lightning. Oh, yeah, we just keep farming on. And that's good as well, so he might send us a... Uh, Oh, he copied Eco for less, which was a big mistake. His powers were not great, to be honest. He had a booster, which wasn't the damage boost. Uh, that was the yellow spider wave, which he now sent because he didn't know we had the lightning. Uh, I'm not going to use another one, just in case something goes terribly wrong. We need another lightning later. And I sell the Glaive Ricochet, get the um, Bionic Boomer. And I uh, don't even know. Oh, yeah, so his powers were the lightning bolts and the improved power boost or something so yeah i'm gonna send one of these he upgrades to that oh, jam packed sex same rush as last time but the team tower's done 
there's not enough time for if you don't have the glue storm yeah you've got yeah, no chance so that's the second game into the third game against Turtle Micro and this was a kind of crazy game to be honest um, so those two games were just some quick this is quite a good video to be fair uh, okay now that sounds really cocky never mind uh, yeah, so we have interchange so that's a not a good map because of how long it is for grinding but um, you know, yeah what I was saying now is because we got two idea uh, examples of how we can grind quickly and now we have a very nice game coming up so um yeah, I'll probably just do this where I just take three random games for the middle of the day and uh, not do the exact grinding grinds until next Wednesday or afterwards. Uh, just because I like to, unless I, uh, I'll probably change my mind, who knows. Anyway, so let's play Dart, which is, um, I'm using my, I don't even know what it's called, Spananza type rush strat with the um, ability lock. And I'm thinking of playing like Mort Attack. Uh, Cobra or something like that, so then I can turn off the attack ability and then you lose that way. But um, a good counter to the strat, as you'll see, is the aces with um, the uh, damage boost. But anyway, yeah, so we've got a farm right in the top corner there, so we can't see how much it's upgraded, which is good because um, if he sees it gets upgraded to a plantation, he's going to be inclined to send pinks and then you're going to lick some lives. But if he can't see when, then um, Unless he guesses it, uh, we'll either be able to defend or uh, have enough to uh, act better. Anyway, so I did not look at him greet. I uh, got a bit focused on my farms and didn't see him greeting really hard. So I just sent a combination of blacks and pinks just so that they lay in a little bit and like caught up. And I uh, took a fair few lives with that, so I was quite happy with that. And then, um, yeah, so we're just going to keep farming on. Uh, the more farms, the bigger the rush later on. Uh, get our wizard down. And yeah, just keep farming. Uh, waiting for this rush. Uh, kind of just banking on at this point, him not knowing about the aces. So I'm going to budget that in. And now the cam grow efficiency. I see he knows the aces. He had the damage boost. It's going bad. We pretty much lost at this point. And he decides to quick shot. We... Uh, used Maelstrom twice, we sell that, we get two Fire Wizards and he all outed us. So, from literally an impossible way of losing, he managed to lose. So, thanks to Turtle Micro for uh, choking really badly to us. He face farmed himself, I said thanks, because he uh, gave us that one. So, yeah, this is the leaderboard so far. We get behind Chest 11 Gang Gang by uh, a small amount. Uh, I'd say kind of split into a top two, but uh, it's a bit too early to call, I'd say. And they're also doing really well on prestige for having low minuses before this. And who knows, maybe I'll have to not try to spire and go for a top three prestige, maybe. Who knows? But, uh, we'll see that. I'll decide that after Friday's grind. So, um, yeah, that was the video today. Uh, hope If you like it, please subscribe. And then, uh, yeah, see you later.